If I check my Python version, as you can see, it is Python 3.11, but I need Python 3.9 for another project. So let's see how we can uh, download and install any Python version. So first, let's go to your browser and let's search for download Python. And let's click on this first link. I'll have this link in the description. Now, as you can see, it is showing download Python 3.12, but this is the latest version. We don't want this, we want an older version, right? So what we want to do is uh, hover over this downloads and don't click on this. And from here, choose your OS, Windows or Mac or other platforms. So I'll choose Windows for now. And here I'll see a list of all the executables that are available still for any Python version. So if I go all the way back, you'll see I am here at Python 3.7 and all this stuff. And at the bottom, okay, I still have uh, installers available for Python 2.6 and yeah, this it was released in 2009. So I don't think you'll need this. So if I need 3.9, I'll go up here. And you can download anything you want, any version you want, but for me, I want Python 3.9, right? So I'll go here and search for 3.9 and it is saying no files for this release. So let me search for control F, type 9, 3.9. Okay, so I don't have any versions available for 3.9.14. .4. Okay, so there are installers available for Python 3.9.13. But uh, practically 131415, they are pretty, uh, practically the same. So you can download anything. Download the installer, not the embedded package. So click on installer. And your Python is now downloading. And since it is downloaded completely, I'll click on open file and open it to install. And I'll just click on uh, add Python 3.9 to path so that I can use Python 3.9 directly from command line. And now click on install now and Python 3.9 is installing. So as you can see, the setup is successful. Now I'll close this and press my Windows button and type Python. Now as you can see, Python 3.9 is available. Now I can click on this Python 3.9 to open Python, uh, this modified and all this stuff. Now let's see how we can use Python 3.9. Again, press Windows and type IDLE. Now you'll see idle editor for Python 3.9 and 3.11. So I click on 3.9 that I just downloaded. And Python IDLE is now open. I, I can write print hello world here. And hello world is printed. So this is now using Python 3.9. Now let's see how we can run files or run projects using Python 3.9. So let's exit this and press Windows again and type CMD. Now, if I type Python version here, now it is showing the one that I have just installed. So now what you can do is you can open your command prompt in any for the root of the any folder and just type Python main.py, for example, this. This is the Python files name that you want to run. Right now, I don't have a main.py, but if I hit, hit enter, it will say can't open file because it does not exist. So if you want to run a file using Python 3.9, you just do this, Python and your file name and you run it. If you have any questions, let me know in the comments below.